Freedom. A two-syllable word with a thousand meanings. Which matters more, my freedom to swing my fist or my freedom to punch you in the face? Scholars remain divided. But there's one type of freedom that's the queen of freedom, yea? The robust, trunk, and turgid root of the great tree of liberty itself, and that is our most fundamental freedom. The freedom, the freedom of speech. speech. Unfortunately, that freedom is now under attack by leftists. I'll fucking kill you for that. I'll kill your face off. I'll kill you too, you white male shit. Fucking white male? Well, you're that's just a privileged you're a piece male, of shit who likes to wear a ski mask male, and spew anti-capitalist slogans you think it makes you look like a badass. Advantage. But it doesn't. It just makes you look like a privileged fucking asshole. Skin color, Are you even a real punk? You look like your mom dropped you off at a Green Day concert in gender identity. I would rather lie down with a goat than continue being in this room. Hold on, I'm not in this field anymore. I don't have to protect anybody. You know what? It was John Cooper of Princeton University, the editor of this very famous Plato anthology. Cooper! This is a call out. A what? Some people think marriage is only between a man and a woman? Who ever heard of such an outlandish idea? <laughs> Luckily, one hero has emerged to champion freedom once again, and that man is no less than YouTube's own Dave Rubin. A man who loves freedom more than life itself. A man who may disapprove of what you say, but will defend to the death your right to appear on his program and spout racist bullshit without interruption or objection. A man who's prepared to water the tree of liberty with his own tears. Are you Check tearing out. up? <laughs> you did something. No, it's uh, there's a, there's the lights are getting me. Uh. Was it the lights, Dave? Are you sure it wasn't? Freedom? I'm chasing a dog down a long, dark hallway. I'm naked, and I'm back in high school, but it's not really high school. When I get to the end of the hallway, there are seven fat heifers and seven emaciated heifers, and that's when the pharaoh tells me how I'm going to die. Tell me, Lao Shu, what is permitted and what forbidden? Well, is it bourgeois not to smash people's faces in the street when you disagree with them? Yeah, that's pretty bourgeois. I will stand up for the bronies. So tell me, Dave, who hates free speech now? Ten points to Gryffindor, my friends! Ten points indeed! I'm honestly not sure that truth and justice will prevail, so if I seem a little on edge, that's probably part of the reason why. Now if you'll excuse me, I'll be heading back to my safe space with a and a big fat which I'm gonna shove deep inside of my This is where I like it. This is what feels good to me. Hello, Comrade Trixie. Hello, Bruce. Oh, the fatuous, overpraised Christopher Hitchens. First great work of political philosophy is Charlie Goes America All Over Everybody's Ass. But also, don't tell black people to toughen up. That is the position of a 16-year-old white kid who's angry that he can't say the N-word. Just multiple camera angles of me being ruthlessly pegged by a giant woman in a lizard mask. And sure, maybe that's not what Milton had in mind when he wrote the Areopagitica, but do you believe in freedom or not, Dave? What percentage of confidence are you at that you're not just being a huge fucking asshole for no reason? Personally, I hate criticism. It's trash. Disability, neurotypicality, like and just body a type suburban wannabe white male you. radical shit, piece male of privilege, shit, white fucking privilege, white male ableist, neurotypical white male, male fucking piece of asshole, piece white of male shit, shit. you fucking white thin cis fucking white male shit. fucking white male. And I will bash you, you gutter punk trash. I'll, I'll bash you shit first, you bougie I'll bash fuck. You good. Fucking fascist, Nazi sympathizing piece of shit. Other patrons who sponsored my golf lessons in preparation for this video. And it would also be nice to get rid of this constant self-doubt and neuroticism and to be able to stop saying, I'm sorry that I invaded your space with my whiteness and my masculinity. I'll try to be meeker and quieter from now on. I am a white man and my experience is valid. Oh my I am beautiful, God. And I'm proud of being beautiful. I'm strong and I'm proud of being strong. Yes, yes, hail victory. 
Hail Trump! I am no mere golden man. I am a golden god! I'm singing in the rain. Just singing in the rain. Tell me, Lao Shu, what is the meaning of freedom? <laughs>